We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Glad tidings we bring to you and your kin. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. La 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 la
is to forgive those that has offended you. It's to do charity. To become an exemplary child of God. And finally, to respect God Almighty. Children, are you listening to me? To show love or to celebrate Christmas is to forgive those that have offended you. And also to do charity by giving something. It doesn't matter whether the item is big or not. Just to give from the bottom of your heart. And that's one of the very best way to celebrate Christmas. This speech will not be complete if I fail to mention If I fail to mention Dr. Business of GM Mali, the proprietress and executive, uh, and the chief executive officer of Wayne International School for his immense contribution to human development. Like I said, the speech will not be complete if I fail to mention Dr. Mrs. GM Madu, the proprietress of Queen of International School and the chief executive officer of the school. I am appreciating her for the immense contribution to human development. Also, I will not hesitate to mention engineer Chimobi Madu, director of Queen of International School for his care and support to both staff and students. With this, I conclude my speech. May this Christmas increase your faith in God, as I wish you Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. Thank you.
quiet place. I want everyone to get a quiet place.
of the shop, the police and the company station are the best dancers for the men. We're going to invite Omar the chair for the first part of the lesson of our happiness. We're going to have to go to Omar the chair. Oh, 
Somebody have offended you, but the birth of Christ today it calls for forgiveness because God forgive us our sins, and this is the time even to reconcile all the past issues, and we should live in peace together. That is the purpose Christ came to the world that we should live in peace and harmony. And as we live in peace, as we hear the gospel. As we believe, God will help us and we will fulfill our destinies in the name of Jesus.
it's a season of love, just like I said when I was giving my speech, that Christmas is a season that we celebrate, that we showcase love. Like yesterday we visit orphanage just to show them love. And that's exactly what Christmas is all about. And that's what we preach at Winnowing International School.